Main reasons of Russian government's love for Trump became clear there is also Ukrainian factor. Speaking on the Russia One channel, Andrei Bezrukov, a former KGB sleeper agent who is now a professor at the Moscow State Institute of International Relations, described Elbridge Colby as the ideologue of young Republicans. According to Newsweek, Colby served as Trump's former Deputy Assistant Secretary of Defense for Strategy and Force Development from 2017 to 2018 and is reported to be in line for a senior national security post in a second Trump administration. He is also a contributor to the 900-page Project 2025 document which was created by right-wing think tank Heritage Foundation. The blueprint proposes to expand the powers of the president, fire deep state civil servants in the federal government to replace them with conservative loyalists, dismantle the Department of Education and other federal agencies, and impose tax cuts. Meanwhile, experts on Russian state TV discussed America's future foreign policy and once again articulated why they prefer the Trump administration based on Trump's current and potential national security advisors they're always talking about. We should look at these guys very carefully. Elbridge Colby is hanging out with three to four young Republican senators. They are also about 40 years old or so. They will sit on the hill for about 30 years. Bezrukov began in a state TV excerpt shared on X by Julia Davis, the founder of the Russia Media Monitor Watchdog Group. Ideologically, they are very hard line. This is the core that can assume the leading position in American foreign policy in the reshuffled Republican Party. Their position is very clear. It's in amazing contrast with US Secretary of State Antony Blinken's, he said. They already said, and Elbridge has been saying it for a long time, we don't need Ukraine at all. Bezrukov continued, it's a distraction on an unworthy object. We should unload this problem onto Europe. They have plenty of money. Let them deal with it. We will deal with the real threat, China. He added, if a loss of Congress really takes place, these guys, Elbridge Colby, will determine the direction of the next Republican administration. He worked with Trump. They do very well together. Tens of thousands of Turkish fans, painting themselves in white and red have flooded streets of Berlin ahead of Turkey's Euro 2024 quarter-final match with Netherlands on Saturday evening. The streets of the capital city is covered with Turkish flags. Some 200,000 people with Turkish roots live in the city, or around 6% of the total population, Turkish fans have brought a lively atmosphere to the tournament, filling German cities with Turkish flags and red t-shirts. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan was also expected to attend the match. Earlier, the Berlin police announced on X that fan zones were being closed due to the weather forecast, adding that these could be reopened depending on weather conditions. Bayram, tek bir bayram, mükemmel bayram. Allah'a emanet.